Welcome back. My name is Mulligan and this is the Laris. We are still playing. We are going to research whatever the system is, unknown 26. And are we moving? Yes. So let's see, what do we have? Okay, nothing in here. It's a nice big system. The barren world, frozen, some barren stuff, nothing special. But this should enable us to go over here to see what we have there. We have the twin, twin, twin fangs, nebula there. <coughs> but nonetheless, we are going out of our way and start to get an army going. So could you? Can you consolidate? Can you can you be together? Merge. There we go. 112 damage. And we are producing more. And the good thing is we can produce even more. We need a lot of and uh, a lot of army. Now this is going Special to cost us a lot complete. of money. We were successful in our attempt to record the collision between Bindor 1 and its moon. The event was captured from several different angles and transmitted live throughout our space. Most importantly, our scientists under the leadership of Zark Itanaka were able to record a large amount of valuable physics data that will surely benefit our research. Guys, 200 experience, 60, 60 data, really. It's not that big. Research was pretty nice, I guess. So I guess project complete. you go over here, survey the system. <coughs> My drone work ethic, let's see. The drones are remarkably efficient at squeezing every diminishing return from rocks Multis miners would have soon discarded. Deemed exhausted of all worthwhile mineral content. Our top engineers are working on adapting the drones method methodology for use in the multis mining networks and stations, which should improve efficiency, effectively lessening energy expenditure. Of lesser import is the fact that the drones are not completely silent. Contrary to previous assumptions, they emit signal pings, though extremely infrequently, and at a wavelength hard to isolate from background noise. If there is anyone left to receive these pings, maybe a mystery for another time. Add the list of mineral-rich planetoids to the situation. situation log updated. Really? I thought I could... What? I don't get anything? Um... This is alien space stuff. The mineral riches. Track on map. Using techniques. Highly value mining targets. Oh. This is not my system. Do I see some? I do see no mining targets. Nope, nothing. Now my question is why their influence grew so sudden. They have to have a base somewhere around there. That is my guess, at least. There we go. Where is... You are going, you are going. Colony ship still waits. Research is Situation going. Updated. We have encountered the rest Cadden systems, these strange Omicron aliens. Um, this is only 17 months. Okay, so they seem to be another race. We do have some sort of ping over there. Oh! So we want to go there. This is the mineral rich planetoid thingy. Good to know. Construction ship is finished. We are now on 60 months. Um, in the meantime, we need more money. We definitely need the money to support our, our war effort. As good as we can, which means we probably want to go over here. Can build a lot of mining stations over here. Uh, someone leveled up, level five now. Incoming okay. transmission. Incoming transmission. 
Uh, we would like to negotiate a trade with your nation. Migration access, migration access. Do you trade last 10 years? Sure. My people are not allowed to migrate, but okay, we can, we can, you can, you can come to us. I don't care. We now have six ships. It is probably not enough, but with 200 or so strengths, we should be able to finally get back our stuff. Okay. Right, this was the system. If we destroy... Oh, we don't have a uh, research ship here anymore. Huh. We definitely need some money. Because our civ our colony ship is... Get, yeah, it's bleeding money. We are bleeding money through this one. And this is a pretty good system. Get all the surrounding. Uh, is now level 3. Good. We're getting more and more ships. There we go. We are now at 200. Nice. Are we researching some... We are researching better reactors. Okay. Which could be good. Destroyer nearly done. In this war, we probably have to upgrade to Destroyer as soon as we can. So we have to save up some uh, minerals. We definitely need those mining stations though. If we get all these three, we get... We only bleed two minerals per month. Which is okay, I would say. Hello, how are you? They are system survey complete. They are doing stuff, okay. Research complete. So we have nothing in here, absolutely nothing. This is useless. We are going to research in this area. We have some research complete. Farming, okay. A regenerative hull tissue, empire leader capacity, edict cost, leader lifespan, food. Okay. Empire modifier food, definitely. Uh, in the meantime, we do we have someone who can fight here? Yeah, we have one. Twenty percent firing rate. There we go. We get we get some nice damage in here. We are still producing one more, which is then nine. Let's make it 10, as soon as we have some minerals. Bep. Let's make it 10. Transmission from Zizana. They appear to have successfully translated stuff. You are probably to the right, correct? Yes, you are. The near confederation. So I guess we can't go over here. Then go survey this system. They have two different areas. What is this? This is the... The... This is another system. This is the Zani Confederate class. Clans. And this is the Avarian and the Stellar Conglomerate. And they have the Twin Star Nebula here. Interesting. We don't see any more Gaia words. Nonetheless, we are getting some money. Construction ship should finish up one of the buildings. We are building the other two. We are bleeding less money then. We have 270 strength. Now the question is, how can I get my armies? Um, I do have ships in orbit. What is that? Uh, fleet. Can't really do stuff with you. Complete. Embark. We are no armies on the surface that can embark. Recruit. <coughs> the next thing we go and recruit is our elite army and some assault armies. Construction finished. Ten ships. Come on, we could get an arms race. Which uh, decreases shipbuilding, army building, space module costs. Hmm. 
bidding cost, energy stuffs, food, happiness. Meh. There we go, we build our elite, uh, elite guards, we build two assault armies, which make three, and then we go and attack. That's all I can really master right now. You are researching, you are researching. I do need two uh, more armies there. We could ask for... Can we do stuff with you? You are a hundred. You should probably like me, right? You are still not willing to get an alliance. We trade stuff. Uh, United Rashiti Confederance Independence. Okay. So they support independence. Interesting. No one is really doing anything with those guys. Which means we are going to make them as rival. Communicate. You have nothing System else. Declare rival. Complete. Having them as our rival will give us 1.8 influence each month and may make their other rival friendlier towards us. Bam. Now we are rivals. Are you are you happy? What do we have? We have a tomb word. What is a tomb word? A rocky word with a nitrogen oxygen atmosphere. It is currently experiencing a nuclear winter with dense layers of sooty aerosols in the atmosphere. High levels of surface radiation minimal signs of life. We have city ruins here. There was something going on over there. Interesting. We have some asteroids. Nothing big, nothing special. Go over to ooh, whatever this is. A nunky pulsar. Nice. Okay. You are recruiting armies. We want more assault armies. Milites could be... It's a defense army. But cannot be transported from the planet. We definitely want some assault armies. There we go. I hope that three armies are enough. Um, fleet order finished. System surveyed. So you have to wait until we get our last alien ships. Okay, what do we have? We have crystalline elites orbiting Nanki, crystalline elites and crystalline elites. We have nothing of value here. We have a toxic word and a barren word. I do guess they don't attack me if I go. They're probably not willing to engage. As long as I stay away. Yep, they just stand there. And I'm gone. We go to Ophale. Ophela? Pyong. We have encountered some form of alien for life force P aliens. We do have some sort of empire over here. Where are the P aliens? Where do we where did we encounter you? Over here? Are you the P aliens? We're gas grazers. You are not the P aliens. Over here. Gas grazers. What the fuck? Where are you? More gas grazers. You are multiplying. This is unbelievable. Whatever, PA in somewhere. Um, we could research some stuff. I mean, enemies are investigating this too, so, you know. Let them do the job. We are shilling. We need to get another assembly, South Army assembled. And with that, we can then go and attack. System so, uh, survey complete. Okay. I definitely want to survey this system. Uh, this is not the system. It's this one. There's absolutely nothing on here. We have a barren word. We have a frozen word. And another frozen word. 
Okay. Sure, enemy agents. As long as you just go far away. One month we can build this fire. Perfect. One month we are more or less, I hope at least, um, attack over them. We have our 10 frigates, which, uh, corvettes, which we can use to attack and, you know, stab at the enemy. Research complete. There we go. Research complete. Now, the question is, how, how expensive is a destroyer? 168. The strength is 50% uh, more. So not that much. Uh, speed is uh, slower, which is natural. Armor is higher, double. And double hit points. So they are stronger. We have new research. We could unlock nano composite armor. Which we probably have to do. Uh, destroy assembly yards, which would reduce cost. Nah. Uh, spaceport. Lock construction of cruisers. We are going for the armor next. We are nearing a war, so... We need to get all the stuff we can get. Move here. Next month you are building a nice little station here. And we are moving my people. I don't think we got any new weapons or stuff. Ooh, they have a lot of weapons. They don't have any medium weapons. Which is interesting. They don't have any medium weapons. We have some medium reactor slots. No wonder you are not stronger than the stuff before. How is the army going? Still recruiting. We are going to get this. Then we are finally on zero. We don't lose any more money. Oh, we found... Okay. So we have an alien fleet of 310 over here. I don't think we can attack the home planet. At least one of your my planets is suffering from starvation. Why? Um, I do not have... I only have one hydroponics farm. Sure. We need... Okay, has finished. We need two months. You know what? We are building one uh, farm more here. And we put you here. This should solve our our starving problem over there. In the meantime, you armies, I want I want all three of you to embark. Embark all. Can I? Can I? Yeah, I guess. No. I can just do it System this survey way. complete. Okay, we are going to go to our the, our colony ship. We have to guide it through here. Survey complete. You need to survey this system. Uh, not much eyes over here. They are pretty holy crap. What do they have? Oh, okay. So their planet has some Bessarian stone. Which we have to one off, okay. The main planet is a gas planet. No, it's not. It's a tropical world. Okay. We ca can't really see armies. Oh, they do have three uh, little guys. Uh, we have Ardex Interplanetary. Hello, please don't. Fuck! It's them. Which means my ships are now not available anymore. <laughs> ah, come on. Okay, well, uh, is fleet order finished? You build this, which is now I am now on plus minus zero. So you go over here, move here, so we can get. 
minerals or credits from there. Construction in the complete. meantime, we are going to build our first destroyer as soon as we can. At the beginning of next month. So now you should not starve anymore, right? You are not starving anymore now. Okay. Enemy fleet. Military power, right. Because you are here. No problem. Fleet, uh, you are moving. Okay. You move around here. You can't move over there right now. You will be able to in a second. In the meantime, right, I want to build a destroyer. I can't. Requires a level 3 spaceport. Okay, so what we are going to do then is clear this. And what about you? You look okay, I guess. Yeah, you look okay. There we go. Now the big question is, okay. The big moment comes. We declare war on this empire. Declare war. Um, add war goals to declare what you seek to achieve with this war. When negotiating for peace, you may only make demands that have first been added here. Select war goals by dragging them from the left list to the right. Vassalizing will place them under your control, uh, under the control of another empire. Mine. Seed planet, seed the ownership of Obervi um, Monoi. Requires the planet to be occupied by an assault army. And seed planet, this is the other one. And li liberate planet, give independence to all planets liberated in a war will form a new empire. With the same assets as the... We are going for... Vassalization. We need 60 war score. We are now at war. Da -da -da. So we go over here. With those two. So it doesn't seem like they have anything else in here. The colony ship is slowly going after. We are not surprised, in fact, yeah, sure, you were the assholes that started this. Can we? Okay, I want vision. Okay. Frontier outpost? They have a frontier outpost? Are you fucking kidding me? There's a frontier outpost. Right. Let's go destroy this. I don't know what the Frontier Outpost is. I want to destroy it though. So you are not going anywhere. So our 10 ships are going and destroying this and... What I... No, I can leave this. If I was to vassalize them. The question is, how do I get points? So the current war score, it measures how well each side is doing. Um, sure, there's probably no ticking war score here. So we wait until they pew pew. Uh, is this whatever is this is? Uh, frontier outpost. Let's hope that it is not doing that much damage. Hostile it has a lot of. Detected. It has a lot of health. They have a fleet of 400 damage. They have 400 power. I have 200. Guys, retreat. Go back. Retreat. Okay, how is it going? We are definitely going to build uh, more corvettes. More corvettes. We need more. There, here they come. They have 14 ships. Okay, so you can just go back. And I can I can leave them here. Research complete. Research complete. Uh, we get new leader stuff. Uh, we generate uh, this takes forever. But okay, let's go for that. In the meantime, they stay here. Construction complete. Um. Now. 
I go in here? Can I pull this off? It's a question. Let's try. Sure, let's try. So they attack this force. Are you are you going somewhere? No, you are attacking. Okay, construction complete. We build something here. And probably food. Yep. New population goes over here, more food. Okay. Main base, spaceport, build, more corvettes. It is not the new month. So they have 400. They have shields. They have shields. They have small deflectors, which I didn't research because reasons. And mm, rockets. Okay, they have deflectors. I don't have deflector. Hmm. Could I research that? Stop researching the selected. Pick another. Any progress already made will be saved. Can I get... No. So, no deflector here. No here. None here. Did I research that deflector? I don't think so. Maybe here. None. And here, none. I don't have deflectors. I didn't research those. So I'm going to put my colony ship to just warp around while they are moving in to attack my fleet. Okay, let's hope that this goes. Could it be that they sped up? Can I? I can't really go outside. I can save up time. Because we need a little bit more time to build those corvettes. Two more corvettes. Um, let me put those transport ships back into my main system. So we need at least 14 and even then we don't really have the firepower to attack them head on. We need some research to finish. Four months until armor is finished, which could turn the tide. Yep. There we go. I, ho I just hope that we are faster than them. Do we see the speed? Their speed is 5.2. Mine is 5.2. I have three armor and zero shield and they have three armor and 50 shield. We are increasing our armor in a bit. We are warping to the next system. So they have to warp after me if they want to engage. Come on. Let's warp and go. Okay. So what we do now is go to the next system. Let's see. I can only hope that they follow me. Oh, my colony ship is here. Okay. What are we colonizing first? This one? Mm, probably this one, yes. I want this colonized. Colonize. And I want it functionable as soon as possible, so probably going here, yeah. Hostile fleet detected. Oh, where? They follow me, okay. This is good. I should go be able to go out. Zap. Before they could arrive, I'm out. So you go back here. Land armies. And you go back here. Yeah, we are still losing money, I know. In the meantime, we are producing more ships. 
More corvettes. A lot more. Research is nearly done, then we can upgrade all our corvettes. And get a lot of... Oh, they are back. I didn't see that. Okay, go over here. You can research this. I don't even know what we are researching there. Uh, Mighty Tassagoid. Okay. We are going to research that. Hostile fleet detected. There they are. Now they are moving in here. Let's see. We now have vision of them. They still want to attack my ships. Which is... Yep, they're coming. Okay. Now... We will wait until they come across. And here they are. And the fight we will keep for next episode. So stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.